I'm a high school teacher always looking to engage my students with magical tools for visual storytelling and I just started experimenting with the Cinemagraph app on my iPad and I'm going to walk you through a little bit of my experience so when you open it up you want to check out the gallery for lots of cool inspiration but what I like to do is really experiment uh, to do that we're going to start in the library so you can of course take lots of video with the internal camera on your iPad but here's a quick example I took uh, last spring using my DSLR perched on the roof of the Google building in Chelsea. So when we're looking at it, we can see that um, there's taxis cruising down 8th Avenue and everything else is static. Now when I took this video, I didn't have a tripod and having a stable surface is critical in, um, in this endeavor. So here's an example that I actually, here's a video I took yesterday in Bushwick and what I know is that, let's see, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to isolate just this area at the top and we're brushing it away, revealing the shadow from the M train uh, cruising on by. And uh, there's one other area that I want to select and that's this area right here. So here we've got the flashing lights from this, um, this restaurant and we've got the, the shadows cast by the M train. But what I also know is that it's floating around a little bit, right, this El Salvador restaurant is like it's merging up I can see that Myrtle Avenue is duplicated so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump to the bottom where I see this timeline and I know that at the end of the video um, I was shifting the camera around a little bit so I'm gonna shorten it substantially and so now when I'm watching that yellow uh, line vertical line scroll across it doesn't um, capture the area where it's bumpy and so this is a far more sort of smooth experience so this looks this looks pretty cool. If we want to add filters, we can certainly do that. Um, and so I'm going to experiment with that right there. That looks good. In the future, I'm definitely going to make sure that I've got my tripod, tripod with my iPad and uh, make some really cool cinemagraphs. All right, if you have any questions, please let me know. Good luck.